Hey guys, my name is Cindy Egg and welcome back to Game Dev Life. You guys seem to love the first episode so much. You destroyed that like button. You left so many comments saying, Cindy Egg, you fool, play some more. So we're back. For episode two guys so as always if you want to see episode three and more of this game make sure the like button down below guys it really does help me out well we're back let's go back to the office hey isabel how you doing did you get a new haircut i don't know but there's a new vault here too coming soon hmm i wonder what that could be all about hey aiden how you doing you happy his happiness is at four ah that's not good aiden that is legit not good we need to get you uh happier Man, is the water in the plant not doing it for you, dude? Is it not doing it for you, dude? God damn it, Aiden. Be happy. Be happy. So today, then, I want to try and do some office expansions. I un can unlock a server room for five Js. Should I do it? Is that the only upgrade at the moment? Yeah, I believe so. Oh, no, I didn't mean to sit down. Damn it. Uh, right. Unlock server room. Boom. And for 8,000, we'll unlock uh, the office to go back a bit. I don't know where I should just yet. Here's the server room. Am I am I at a high enough level? I'm at level two. I don't know if I'm at a high enough level just yet to be using servers. I'm not 100%. But let me build. Um, wrong menu. Damn it. Uh, servers. Where's the servers then? Server, server, servers are here somewhere. Where vintage server. It's currently locked. I got unlucky, haven't I? Hmm, yeah. Right. No! I'm so down too far! Right, I gotta change my camera mode again. <laughs> it's funny when that happens. Right, there we go. Put it back, put it back. Okay, so what I'm gonna do then is expand a little bit more. We'll set up these server rooms at some point as well. Also, we gotta upgrade this as well. What what is this um unlock? Modern setup, tier one. Water dispenser, drinks machine, tier two. Ooh. You get quite a stuff when you upgrade and stuff like that, right? It's unlike, go back a bit more. I'm so sorry, Aiden. Right, how do I move him? Move. First, fire the employee. I don't want to fire... You know what? I'm going to fire Aiden. Right, fire him. Solely because... I can then hire someone new. Right, bam. Oh! I can hire two people. Hold on. Right, place that down there. I can upgrade that as well. I Should Should I upgrade? Yeah, I feel, I, I feel like I'm going to upgrade him. Right, why is this shop not opening? I gotta scroll to the top. I forgot about that. Right, okay. So I need to get. Um, I can't even get that. Oh, there we go. Basic PC setup. Right, we got a basic one. Right, let me cancel that. Hold on. What else have I got to choose from? Drop monitor. Nah. I can't get this one yet. Yeah, it's still locked. I feel. Like, I think that's the kind of stuff yeah, you have to research. I rotate. There we go. So we got the good desk against the bad desk, which is not good. And I can't change that. You can only change the uh, laptops, the custom Zediac laptop skin, which is good. Uh, right. Who we got? Who's going to be better? Um, see, I'm going to hire Jack. He seems like a cool dude. There he is. He just appeared, like, randomly. And can I hire another employee? Let's see. Who's got the higher... Um, Plus. And Josh. Let's go with Josh. There he is. Right, we got two people here. I feel like it's time. We should legit now make a new game. Should we just jump into it? Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Okay. So profit boosts. Oh, you wouldn't like that kind of stuff? That's kind of cool, isn't it? You can like all that stuff. Right, anyway. Right. I'm getting too carried away here with all the stuff that you can actually do. It's too exciting for me. Again, it's a develop a new game. It's going to be... Now, I asked for you guys to give me some pretty cool game suggestion names. And um, i got to find them quickly. One okay, second. So, Damien Duke says, uh, pick RPG. Okay. RPG, Damien. Got it. Then he says, pick RGP, RPG uh, Sports. Right. And he says, you can role play as being a footballer. And he says, the most famous footballer is Ronaldo. So call it Ronaldo. I think I spelled it right there. 
Yeah, pretty much. So, guys, if you want to give me some game suggestions, and uh, I'll pick one each episode, and I'll create one of you guys' game suggestions. So leave it down in the comments down below. I can't wait till we get to, like, the simulation kind of um section. We need to, like, level up one more time. Right, so where are we going? Where are we going with this? PC, bam. Console, bam. I haven't unlocked anything else yet from being level two. No, not quite. Okay, so budget. Uh, ooh, we can actually do price for, like, uh... Early access? Okay, we do... What's the maximum you can pull it at? Right, we'll pull it at five. Five for early access. That sounds kind of cool, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, so so servers, we can't really use them anyway until we get to that level five for online. So there's no point buying any servers just yet. Uh, do you know what? No, I'm getting this completely wrong here. This is the price of the game i got to select. Right, we're going 25 smackaronis. Um, early access, Can I can I select that? Requires at least one employee. I don't know. Right, finish that up anyway. Okay, so role playing uh simu no role playing sports game. Sounds graphics all the way up. Level design up to finish. Let's go. Right, Josh, Jack, you best make make this the best game in the whole entire world. I am counting on you, you damn fools. They should do a good job. Hopefully, 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 man. Hopefully. I just realized, well, you can't really see my finger. There we go. Change it all up. You could see my uh, my level and uh, my XP and stuff. Right, gameplay high. Whoops, a daisy. I forgot to click the slider. AI high. A little bit of a story too. <clears throat> it's going to be beautiful. This game is going to be beautiful. It's going to sell millions of copies. <laughs> We're going to become the richest people in the whole entire world. What are you going to do about it? Right, come on. Phase 2 development. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ba -ba 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 Bam! Have we done it? Yeah, boy. So, character design, we left high. Dialogue a little bit. And R and I, I. UI up really, really high as well. Right, sweet. I'm excited for this then. I'm excited to get another game out. I'm going to try and make some more cash money moolah. I want to try and get to level 3. Once we get to level 3... What did we unlock at level 3, by the way? It was... Oh, no. Simulation. Simulation game. I can make so many good simulation games once I get that level unlocked. Right. Is this going to be a good one? Oh, it's out of 100. Nice. Oh, this is all changed from the last time I played it. So, it's 53 out of 100. It's not amazing. But Double J Games says it's an 8. It's really addictive, apparently. Uh, right, so we gotta get out of here. We gotta run into town. Or people were saying, Seniac, it's not a town, you damn fool. It's city. Well, it's, you know, it's England. England is my city. So we're on the way to now get some boxes. And put it in stock in the store. We're gonna sell loads of these. I have a good right. feeling. Request a small crate, please. Where's my small crate? Hold E. Got a crate. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's rock and roll. I also, as well, guys, I found out that vehicles are coming very soon as well, which is, I can't wait for them. It means I can take a break. I can chill out. I can relax. I no longer have to do the speedy Gonzalez running through the tunnel with the boxes. I can't wait to start driving. How cool is that going to be? We can actually explore the city a lot more. As we go past that dude. Oh, man, this is so cool. Right, let's get in then. Let's put the box in the store. Let's run up the stairs, Sediac. Run. Run as fast as you can. In it goes. Right, let's drop the box down. Boom. And let's sell the game. Right, sweet. Right, do we release the game? Or do we should we get another crate? Right, I'm, I'm going to grab another crate quickly. And on the way to running back. Yeah, you know what? We'll release it now. How's it doing? Profit. We made 2,000 so far. We sold 79. To be honest, I don't feel like he's going to do very well. This game. It is a weird combination. I will say that. Uh, not the best. So, damn it, Damien Duke. You damn fool. You made... Wait, well, then again, it is kind of selling a little bit, right? Oh, I'm stuck. Uh, it's made 8,000. Not great. Right, let's request another small crate. Boom. We got a crate. Let's go. Let's go. So we need one more. We need one more to get in stock. Let's run home, boy. Let's run. How's the game doing? We made 13,000. It's not... 
It's not amazing, is it? It's not amazing. We, we've definitely had better games. That's 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 all I'd say about that. We've definitely had better games than this. Than Ronaldo. <laughs> but hopefully our next one could be a, a top bestseller. Who knows? We can only pray. We can legit only pray right now. All right, let's get the box in then. Uh oh, missed it. I missed the stairs completely. Run up the stairs. There we go. Into the office. Drop the box. There you go. You sell games. Bam! There we go. We got more on sale. So hopefully, what we sell it now? Twenty-one thousand. Killing it. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. So there at we all. go. We made twenty-six thousand in profit. Finish. You still have pending orders during the next 30 days or you lose customers and profit. Don't worry. I'm all over this. So we've sold the game. We got nearly 30 Gs in profit. But obviously, we didn't haven't delivered enough crates just yet. So we still got some of them pre-orders that we gotta you know get to the people. People have bought them, they're waiting for their game to get delivered. And your boy has gotta get a crate to the store so those people can get sent their very own games of Ronaldo! Ronaldo! <laughs> right, we're gonna deliver this crate, we're gonna get back to the office, and we're gonna create the biggest, the best, the greatest game of all time. That's cool as well, guys. We got 49 XP, so we're like a quarter of the way to get into level three, where we can start creating simulation games. Right. Boom! There we go. We did it. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Right, let's get back to the office then. Let's go. Okay. So we're now back to the office. Hey, Isabel, how you doing? Right, Josh, Jack, are you okay? I feel like I should put in some office-like improvements to make them a little... Ooh, should I place down a wall? Ooh, right, rotate this. Can I drop this down? Bring it back a bit. How easy would it be to place this in? About there, maybe? How does that look in there? Right, we'll try, we'll try. Now, do you know what? No, I won't do it just yet. Because I want to fill up the um, the office with, uh, like, kind of... Inter not in the same stuff, but like, stuff that will keep them happy. Keep their happiness up. Maybe, like, a fish tank. How would the... F Whoa, that's a big fish tank, isn't it? Okay, maybe not a fish tank just yet. I need a little bit more room for that. Right, happiness. Uh, drinks 80 Gs for one of those. Whoa! Crazy! That's legit crazy. I ain't got that kind of money just yet. I'm gonna work harder. Right, I'm gonna have to put it like, do you know what? I probably will get them. Yeah, I'll get them the fish tank. If I could squeeze it in. There we go. The fish tank is in. It looks weird and out of place. What about if I move it? Hmm. Rotate. There we go. It's in, a, it's in a very weird place, isn't it? Yeah. That could be something cool that we could put, like, centralized to our office. But for now, it's okay. It's okay. Right, we're jumping onto another game then. Let's get this started. I need to get to level. To level three very soon. Uh, we can advertise the current game as well. That's something I haven't even tried to do just yet. Right, start a new game. Let's pick then myself. Let's go for a shoot. No, yeah, should we go? Yeah, let's go for a shooter. Right, and we're going to pick animal. An animal shooter. It's going to be... What animals do you shoot? You shoot like ducks, isn't it? Duck hunter. There we go. Duck. Duck hunter. It sounds slightly scary at the same time. Duck hunter. Yeah, I'm so ready for this. Okay, that's going to jump onto the pace, eh? And uh, the sodacy. Going to kill it right now. That's also going to be 30 smack of Rooney. No, should we go 35? Let's go 35 smack of Roonies. Small game. Yep, 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 yep. We're good to go. We're good to go. And um, let's see. So, Duck Hunter. We have level design and graphics up. And sounds up a bit too. Not, not, not by too much, though. We don't need many sounds. It's just quack. That's the only sound we need. And poof, for the gun sound. <laughs> That's all we need. That's all we need, man. Come on, Josh. Come on, Jack. Hey, Isabel. How you doing? Right, come on. Get a fish. We got Nemo's in the fish tank. Didn't even spot those there. Did not even spot those. So, story, a little bit. AI high, gameplay high too. 
We're rocking and rolling with these. I can't wait till we fully expanded a lot more. We need more money though. But once we fully expanded even more, we can like, you know, have all these huge elaborate offices with all these people working for us. And we create like those walls and stuff to place down. Ah, oh, it'll be so good. It'll be so good. Right, come on. So character design will have high. Dialogue, there's not much dialogue. Art and UI high as well. I feel like, I feel like that's all we're going to be needing, isn't it? That's, all, that's really all we're going to be needing. So we'll see how this rolls now. We'll see how it rolls. Come on. Let's go. Phase three. I'm ready. I'm ready to see the reviews for this game. Right, here we go. It's an 83 combination. Oh, man, it's 72 out of 100. Yeah, boy. CEO of Row Magazine and Blocks Go Magazine. Get out of here. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? Right, the game is... Uh, can I advertise the current game? Not enabled. I don't think that's a feature just yet, is it? No. Okay, fair enough. Right. Um, creating the game. It's beastie. I'm quite excited for this game to come out. So let's head and go and grab some more from the factory. Some boxes. We're going to put into stock. Now, this one technically should sell a lot more than Ronaldo. Because Ronaldo was like 50%. This one's like 72 So, yeah. We're going to make some serious Bam! money today. I got the crate. Do you know what? I've never really looked in here. Look at this factory. What? This is kind of elaborate, isn't it? Did these move? Man, I mean, there's offices up there and everything. Could you imagine? I mean, this game's in, again, it, it, it's in alpha. Could you imagine what that potentially could be? Could you imagine if you can get a job and work in there? Like, on the side, like... If you're struggling to make money with games, get like a side job where you work in the factory to pack boxes. Oh man, do you imagine how cool that would be? And then you can get like another job where you work in the store or, or any of the other buildings that are in the city. Oh man, this game has has so much potential. I'm so excited for this. Right, should we go check out the cars too? I feel like we're going to drop this box off and go see what cars uh, are going to be like there that we could buy soon. Because I'm quite excited for when the vehicles are in. Right, let's get in. Drop the quake. The quake. The quake has been dropped. <laughs> so, games. And do we need another box now? We released the game first. Has it selling? Nearly five Gs in profit already. Right. Let's go check out these cars. I want to see all about them. See what's going to be coming. Um, how are we selling now? Nearly ten Gs in profit. Man, this game's going to make a lot of money. Wow, look at the cars here. We got like uh, vans, like pickups. Normal cars and stuff like that. Could you imagine that? Like, you, you buy a van or a pickup and you go to, like, get some crates. And you store the crates in the back and stuff like that. Could you imagine that? That would be so good. Right, how much money have we made now? 20 Js! What? Holy moly! Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. That, that's... 25 Js nearly, almost. Right, this game's making some serious cash. We're going to grab another box, pull it back into stock... And, whew, man, making all the money. Right, I got, I got another crate. I got another crate. Here we go. We're about to put it back in stock. I want to see how much money we made then. Right, drop this in. Excuse me. Boom. We dropped it in. Is the game selling well? You want another box? How well is this game selling? Holy moly. 45 Gs. 47 right now. We're, we're making some serious cash off this game right now. How crazy is that? Right, am I racing this person there? Right, game alert is about to go off sale. You still have pending. Yeah, fair enough. 47, nearly 50,000. We nearly sold a thousand copies. Is that our highest selling game? I feel like we've already made like a, a game that sold more than that. But what? Right, that's crazy. That's crazy. Right, I'm going to drop this next box off so it's all in stock and we can get rid of the rest of the pre-orders and stuff like that. And then we'll make one more game this episode, guys. We'll make one more game and see if we can get it even better than that. Holy moly. Right, back in we go. And I feel like I want to like move some of this stuff around. And I'm going to move the plant here now. Just put it a little bit closer to these guys. So you can feel more at home with all this stuff placed around them. Right, move the water dispenser. Let's rotate that there. Let's throw that there. And um, let's see, we've got 150 Gs. So, um, 
Let's see. Do I make him more happy with uh, the drinks machine? Now I can afford one. Yeah, why not? We're throwing a drinks machine there. I can afford it, so I'll do it. Then place this. Let me rotate that. Bam. Yeah, boy. Right, what else can we buy? Um, let's see. Let's see. There's a standard light. Does that actually work as a light? Where does it go? Oh, it goes in the ceiling. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it actually does work really well. How cool is this office coming along now, guys? Why is my... I'm like a zombie. Ugh. Give me your brains. <laughs> well, let's jump back on then. Right, so the cash is coming. We're we getting the boosters here, guys. We're getting the profit boosters, which is really good. Uh, okay. Develop a new game. Oh, man. We are so close to getting to level three. I can't wait to get to it and start unlocking simulation. We're going to be killing it. Right, so we've done, a, we've done an RPG. We've done a shooter. Let's go for an action. Let's go action this time. We'll go action. Hmm. I'm not sure which one to go for. This is something guys well. I think next episode I'll look at trying to get the research room all set up so we can start researching some more topics and stuff like that. Uh, so we've done animal, we've done sports, an action racing game. We call it. We, we did like car. Was it car crushes we did last time? Should we create car? Car? Uh, cr yeah. Cr no. Cr car crushes two. We're making a sequel, guys, to the original. <laughs> right, PC. Console. Let's do this. Right, it's going to be 40 smackaroonies. We're going big on this game, guys. We're going big. So we're going to have um, an action racing car game. So sounds high, graphics high. Uh, we don't need too much for the maps and stuff. Level design. It's just tracks and crashing and whatnot. We want, we want quality high, high resolution, high quality cars and crash noises that's what we want in this game we want the best noises in the world <laughs> that's what we want in this game right so story not really a story ai is going to be high like maxed out so you want good ai to um, compete against when you're doing the car crashing it's like demolition derby that's what it's going to be basically like that's the kind of gist of it right let's go stage two I can't believe we spent like 80 G's on the uh, vending machine. Hopefully that makes them a lot happier. Hopefully. Just going to pray to Jesus. Right, come on, next. Uh, character design. Mm, dialogue. Mm, more character design than dialogue. But art and UI, very high. Very high, mate. Very, very high. <laughs> right, stage three is almost done. We're, we're like legit halfway there. This is going to be the... Hopefully... Hopefully this is the greatest game we've ever made. Could you imagine if we got like a 100% game? How crazy would that be? That would be like hacks. <laughs> I almost had a heart attack then. Could, uh, I was about to say, could you imagine if I had a 100% game? And then all I seen straight away was 100%. But 77, this was better than the last game. So technically... We should, I mean, we sold 40, was it like 47, 48,000 copies last time? We should style at, you know, over 50,000 this time. Yeah, boy, awesome. We got a 10. We legit got a 10. Oh, man, this game's on fire. Let me just quickly check out these dudes anyway. Uh, happiness is 56. Happiness is 58. So, yeah, that's actually doing its job, which is good. And, and maybe this as well. Oh, man, it's so annoying that you got the walkway there, but you can use it as a divider for the office. Right, let's get out of here. Let's go down to Brown Town. And let's get some crates and sell. Car Crushers right, 2. Here we go. The sequel to the first Car Crushers game. Car Crushers 2. It's going to make so much cash money moolah right now. Right, drop that off. Bam. Right, thanks. You put them on sale. Yeah, boy. Release that game. How much you made? We've already made six Js already. What? And you know what's called as well? We know it's going to sell more than last time because it's a higher rating. But we also chose for it to be at such a high price as well compared to the last one. So, technically, we should make like at least 50, 60 Gs, maybe? I mean, we only made 12,000. 18,000 now coming in thick and fast. We are on fire right now. I need to get another box to keep up with these pre-orders. This is crazy. Right, come on. I'm ready to see the next one. 
25 G's. Yeah, that's it. We are now rich. We are now rich. We're the greatest. Around. Nothing's ever gonna bring me down. I got another box ready for just a second, but look at this. All our games are now on the shelf. We're, they're selling like hotcakes right now, guys. How much have I sold? I sold nearly a thousand copies for 55 G's profit. What? That's crazy. That is legit crazy. We now sold over a thousand copies. I also got 6,000 fans as well, which is like really good. I'm only 50 XP away from uh, level three. So I think next episode, we can start actually making some simulation games as well. That's gonna be pretty cool uh, to uh, check out. We've got 60 Gs minimum right now. Guys, look at me. I'm like a ninja right now. I can't believe how many, how, many, how much we've actually made from this game. This is kind of crazy. Dude. I don't know. I don't know what you're saying. Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Game alert. Off sale. So you're still pending. Yeah, fair enough. We made 63,000 profit. The game price is 40. Total sales, 1,000 copies were sold. Right. Let's throw this box in. Boom. I threw the box in. There we go. Congratulations. You got the uh, copies. We now create another game. Sure. I slowly made my way back to the office. Guys, I can't wait. I'm hoping, I think, I'm not I'm not 100% sure. Don't, you know, don't call me on this. But maybe we might see vehicles in the next update. And how good would that be? No longer would we have to do this long walking process, which would be pretty cool. Uh, we did some pretty good games today. I've got 139 in the bank, which I've also extended the office. Built the server room ready for when we get servers and stuff like that. So next episode, I want to try and focus on getting like a research center set up. Which will be able to like research a bunch of stuff that we can unlock and use. Uh, hopefully I get to level 3 as well. So I can then, you know, create some pretty sweet simulation games. Which is going to be like really, really good. So next episode is looking like it's going to be an exciting one. Only if you guys want to see more of it. So if you do, guys, make sure you hit the like button down below. If you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So good. Bye. Listen.